Dominic Ansel, chef owner of Dominic Ansel Bakery in New York City. And today we're going to make a midnight cereal snack using Montague Vector Convection Oven. So we start off with uh, some uh, Rice Krispie where uh, we're gonna add the corn syrup and some sugar. So once this is mixed, we're gonna pour into the sheet pan and we're gonna put this in the Montague oven. It's gonna take about like eight to 10 minutes at 350 degrees. So here we have our caramelized Rice Krispie and now we're gonna mix it with our caramel tempura chocolate. And we're gonna pour into the sheet pan and let it sit in the fridge. So next, we're gonna do the caramelized hazelnut. For this, we're gonna mix the sugar and the water together, cook it to 121 degrees Celsius, add a little drop of red food coloring, then add the toasted hazelnuts, and then when we uh, caramelize it together, we add the powdered sugar and then the salt at the end. So the next step is going to be the strawberry Swiss meringue. So we start up with uh, mixing the powdered sugar and egg whites. We're gonna place the meringue into a water bath and cook this mix to 45 degrees Celsius. Once it's done, we're going to mix it with a, with a mixer using a, a whisk. Once the meringue is whipped and still warm, we're gonna add the red food coloring and the strawberry compound. So the next step is going to be to pipe those meringues. So we're gonna put this meringue in the, into a pipey bag and pipe a little uh, kisses with it. And next we're going to sprinkle those uh, meringues with some sanding sugar, red sanding sugar. And this will dry in the oven for about one to two hours, depending how big you find them at very low temperature. So what I like about the Montague oven is that there's a good repetition of the heat. So we don't have to rotate the tray through the process of baking. And also it's very powerful and quick. So now we're going to assemble everything together. We have our caramelized chocolate coated rice crispy, our caramelized hazelnuts, and our strawberry mini meringues that we're gonna to combine together. Here, this is how we package it at the bakery in a large cylinder box. It's good for two people and it's perfectly nice bag. Nice